Hello, Collective. Welcome back to the Ascended Divination Priestess channel. You are greatly appreciated. Please remember to like, comment, share, subscribe to the YouTube channel. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your families as always. I return to source. I return to sender. All negative energies and intent immediately and permanently. I call in on it the purest of white light and pray that you stay on it in the highest of vibrational energies. Whatever the enemy is stolen from you, is trying to steal from you, it is returned to you. All evil and negative plans of your enemies against you are dismantled and being dismantled as we speak. As I have said, so shall it be. The judgment is final. Hello, collective. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back, welcome back, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Okay, so we have someone that's paying for you to be stopped for something to be stolen from you. Um, there's still some type of effort, manipulative effort going on to have something stolen from you, to also block you from meeting someone or to block someone from meeting with you. So be very cautious and vigilant because whoever is paying someone to stop you, block you, steal from you, take from you, causing manipulations, wanting you to be uh, in prison. Like someone is very desperate out here. I feel like this is a queen of wands that's trying to alter some type of justice from taking place. This could be a queen of swords as well, or this is a queen of wands reverse coming after a queen of swords. People are seeing the truth about someone, but there's still a woman out here that is unhinged and still determined to have things go in her favor. I don't know if this has something to do with a lot of money and she's trying to force something to go in her way. It's not going in her way. Some type of judgment is against this woman on a universal level and she's in denial. Denial is a river in Egypt. People don't want to accept it. It is what it is, um, but someone is absolutely paying for you to be stopped, for you to be blocked, for something to be stolen from you. This could be your inheritance, your intellectual property, uh, just whatever, your energy. Maybe someone is relying on your energy, or this could be someone trying to steal some type of relationship or opportunity from you, and everything is being balanced out. Everything is being shown uh, or review, exposed. Listen, look at that. I'm telling you, everything is being balanced out. There's some type of plotting going on. Either you've already escaped this or you're going to be able to narrowly escape it or something. I think you already did because the people are still fighting behind the scenes due to some type of victory you are having. You could be a king of wands having some type of victory out here trying to figure out how to balance the situation out for yourself. And yeah, and for a high priestess, you're listening to your intuition now and your intuition is telling you to leave these people out in the cold so you can have this wish fulfillment in life that you've always wanted to have or that you have awakened to. So something, some type of relationship with you and a family is over. Um, you are choosing to heal, balance yourself out and move on. Maybe you want to balance things out with an Empress energy, build some type of Ten of Pentacles. Someone could be a Queen of Swords right now, but they're very committed to their, their past your business, whatever this is that you have your eye on, you absolutely want to have some type of new beginning and have had destiny playing out, balance the situation out, as I had said earlier. So there's some type of plan, planning going on uh, behind the scenes. I don't know if it's you, the King of Wands, that uh, is wanting to balance things out. Honestly, I think it is. Um, or there's somebody else behind the scenes. Or it could be you that's trying to cause some type of hindrances to someone. Maybe you're trying to block a King of Pentacles from going. Uh, taking some type of step, uh, steps in his life to balance his life out or to make some type of offer. Uh, there could be a Queen of Wands in the background of both of you that maybe you're not aware of. Um... And you are going to have to pay attention to this woman because someone is absolutely an unhinged creature. She feels like something should go to her or she feels like someone does not deserve something that maybe you, the King of Wands or the King of Pentacles is trying to give them. Uh, and this is solely based on color. This is solely based on insecurities. We've talked about this woman, I don't know how long, three months now. Baby, I'm over it. I'm over it. <clears throat> Anyways. 
there could have been some type of plot to take you out but someone was not able to and they had to end up walking away eventually people will have to walk away you will be receiving what is yours in due time like something's going to come right to you in the nick of time um i don't know what that means maybe you are not expecting something and you are in some type of situation um and this is going to come to you this offer it's going to come to you just in the nick of time. Excuse me, I, need, I should have brought a pen to write my title down. Because when I'm done with these videos, um, maybe I can never remember the title that I want to write down. So I got to make up stuff and it's never what I want it to be. So excuse me, this is a little unprofessional. I don't like to be moving around when I'm doing my video. But here it is, the first time for everything. So you all see me, I'm always sitting down. Sorry, folks. Sorry, folks. Oh, Lord. Okay. Here we go. And excuse me while I write my title down so I don't forget it. Okay. Lord have mercy. Okay. There we go. I just write key words that I want to use. <laughs> Lord have mercy. The lack of professionalism. Okay, let's go back in. Let's get back into this read. Anyway, someone may have been sent to you to take you out, block you, stop you, destroy you. Um, but you may have escaped something barely with the skin of your teeth. Um, and you were able to get away or walk away. You may be leaving some type of environment, leaving some type of uh, location, maybe home or some type of toxic family dynamic. I think you may be seeing life from a whole new perspective with that eight of cups out here. Uh, you're moving on with your life. I don't know if you're like throwing away the whole family because you found out the whole family is not exactly family. There's a lot of toxicity going on. Uh, but it's just a little bit too much being ex uh, exposed to you. And I don't know how all of this is being exposed to you, but there's some type of revelation that has taken place and it has opened your eyes your eyes uh, to a different world, a different perspective, how to live. There could be some type of uh, a research going, in, going on or some type of investigation going on. Um, when it comes to a whole friendship group or a family dynamic, maybe they don't know that they are being investigated or someone is looking into them to see the kind of things that they've been indulging in. Someone out here could be very manipulative. There could be like a father figure, boss figure, husband uh, that does strange things for money, odd favors for money. So basically, this is someone that uh, will accept pay to do these kind of work, okay? These miscellaneous kind of work, right? Mischievous works, okay? So he doesn't mind uh, accepting money to block people to uh, basically uh, block your destiny, Block you from receiving financial abundance. So if you if you've been investing in something, this is someone that'll come in uh, after he's been paid to block you in whatever way. Maybe technology interferences, uh, slander, lying, gossip, all kinds of stuff. This is what this father figure or boss figure is into. I've been picking up on an emperor that's just doing a little bit too much out here. Does not really behave as an emperor. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of a read on him in the next video. So hopefully everything you need to know comes out in that video so that you are aware because there is some type of unhinged creature out here that feels entitled to you and it's just, it doesn't make sense. And that's because he's being paid hefty. He's being paid a hefty amount to block your future. To, uh, I don't know, present himself as something he's not causing some type of illusions about you or something like that, but he's being paid hefty uh, behind the scenes to make something or someone look like what it is not or they are not, okay? Um, so you are going to be leaving some type of uh, situation. I don't know if you're traveling. I don't know if you're coming out of prison or you're coming out of some type of ment uh, self-imposed mental imprisonment and you are going on some type of journey and there this is what people are trying to stop you from doing is going on this journey meeting with whoever you're supposed to be meeting with this could be someone you consider to be someone of high honor of feminine energy 
you uh, consider to be of high honor, someone that has self-respect, someone that may be spiritually abundant, even materialistically abundant, or this they are set to be very abundant, okay? You may see someone as very straightforward, and maybe this bothered you before, but now you are appreciating that very trick about them because you are finding out that your family or whoever your friends are, they are not exactly honest with you and maybe have been betraying you. It's a lot of swords out here. We got the freaking five of swords, seven of swords, eight of swords, ten of swords. That's too many swords. There's a lot of mental manipulation going on amongst you all or in your family that you are finding out. You may be finding out that someone is just a narcissist as well around you um, and you are having to kind of accept that reality. I don't know what kind of life this is you are in. I really don't care, people. I don't give... <laughs> I don't really care, people. Live your life. Do whatever you want. Leave the rest of us alone, okay? Leave the rest of us alone. We are too focused on our destinies and pathway and things like that. But you all are too focused and obsessed uh, with manipulate, manipulating destiny, manipulating people's energy, manipulating with words so that you can have things go in your favor. We are sick of this nonsense, folks. Come on now. Come on. You want to be karmic, that's fine. But be karmic over there. Leave the rest of us alone. Let us live our lives in peace. Thank you. Clarity, clarity, clarity. Let us live our lives in peace. We don't want nothing from you. Okay? If there's something, an opportunity, a relationship you're trying to have with someone else, a star seed, and a karmic woman says she deserves it. Listen, baby. Listen, 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 sir. Listen. Listen, Johnny. Go ahead and stick with the karmic lady because we star seeds don't got time. We are tired. Okay? Go ahead. Go ahead and give her that opportunity. She'll find out you don't got time for her when you start, you know, going out with your options. When you don't touch her, she when you don't give her what it is she wants, maybe she'll come back down to reality. Go ahead. Tell her I pick you. <laughs> Tell her, you know what? You know what, Melissa, girl? I don't know what I was thinking. I pick you. I choose you. And then when you start to neglect her, you don't give her the money she was expecting. You don't give her the position she was expecting. You don't give her the love she was expecting. Maybe her true colors will come out. <laughs> It'll come out real quick. They want you to go to the past and stay in toxicity. Listen, play along with the people's games. Play along with their games. Oh, you what? Oh, okay. All right. You want me to go back to my toxic girlfriend, toxic wife? You mean after I don't awaken, you want me to go? Listen, someone is up here wide awake. Wide awake. Okay. Wide awake and taking charge of their life, moving forward in victorious. And moving forward victoriously. Okay. And this is all because he has foresight now of a situation. Listen, listen, sir. Sir, sir. <laughs> We need your karmas to leave our light workers alone because there's some type of unhinged creature out here that just feels like something belongs to her. You belong to her. An opportunity belongs to her. A business belongs to her. Whatever it is, we don't care. We don't give a damn. We don't give. Whew, we, we, we don't care. Give it to her. You'll find out the truth eventually. Okay? Because this is how she's out here right now. I've said that you a leader, a spiritual leader, or whatever you are, you're working very hard to get out of the cold or to balance something out with an institution or to have an institution do the right thing. Trying try, try, try to just figure out an opportunity on how to fix a something that has been broken. I don't know if you, the higher fin, the leader of the community, has uh, gone through some type of metamorphosis and you're choosing to move on with your life because something is just too dark. You're listening to your intuition now. Okay? But I don't know. Listen, lady. Maybe I'm talking to a woman that's out here trying to steal from people. I've been picking up on this queen of wands for a long time. Queen of wands reverse. Just out here determined to destroy. And then you got a queen of swords reverse that does her things from behind the scenes. Women be going from community to community. Just manipulating, lying, deceiving. Just, just, it's just too much. All in effort to block someone's new beginning. Block someone's opportunities. Block someone's originality. Block someone's authenticity. Like everything about you, they want you to block. They want, they want it to be blocked. Not happening. 
You got endless opportunities coming in. You're innovative. You could be a king of cups. King of cups. Okay. There could be another king of cups that's been causing a lot of that's been causing a lot of illusions behind the scenes. Yeah, maybe this has something to do with your abundance. Okay. This has this has something to do with your abundance. But it's all being settled. It's all being straightened out by the universe. You don't got nothing to worry about. Looks like you two will be meeting. Be cautious of someone being paid to come towards you as well. I have to put that out because I'm picking up on it. You may have some type of lunatic being paid to come towards you and pin themselves out as some type of twin flame. Wants you to pick them as a choice and think that you two are going to be successfully closing the chapter when all when the whole time is all a plot for them to take you out or for them to bind you to a situation. You got no business being bonded to. It ain't nothing wrong with being single. It is nothing wrong with second guessing whoever is coming towards you because all these people, they know each other. Okay? Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Stay blessed. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.